Hey guys, uh, this is my second video for the Coco Par 15 inch monitor. I just want to show you some gaming performance. Right now, I've got uh, Pro Evolution Soccer 20 running on it. Uh, the game is just starting, as you can see, the graphic looks amazing on this monitor, and the sound is coming out of that monitor as well. It's kind of low, uh, but see if we get 100%. You can see the touch screen interface for that monitor I'm not sure how good this video is coming out on, on how the resolution itself over it shows on here I was just looking at the monitor it, it, its colors are vibrant and the, the, the graphics are really nice And since if Xbox is running right now at 4K, 60 hertz native, uh, so you cannot control anything like brightness or saturation. You got your other control for uh, rotation, and this shows that it's a USB HDMI connection right now. So if you, drive, uh, you can say the change the color modes if you want. I've currently set it as user cannot change any of these predetermined settings uh, like game mode or video mode uh, since it's uh, currently an HDR mode so it, you cannot change these you can see HDR is auto or currently on And that's a goal. Goal, the United States. As you can see, beautiful graphics. Looks pretty cool. So I'm gonna switch over to another uh, input uh, to my Surface Pro to show how that's that's connected uh, via USB-C. And in the meanwhile, uh, the other game will probably load. I'll see if I can load uh, either Assassin's Creed to show you how that that looks on this. And uh, so, all right. So now I got my Surface Pro connected to it as an extended desktop. I uh, just want to show uh, the touchscreen's control. You can see if I want to open a file, double click on it. Oh, sorry, it's opening on the other window. So let's see here. So since this is set up as my extended desktop, so it's, let me change that and make that as two. So if I open up, let's say uh, some pictures, maybe you can see that. Mm -hmm. Hopefully this oh, it's open on the other side as well. So this is just some pictures I took of the monitor while uh, I was testing out decks. So as you can see here and here's my laptop. Our surface were connected to the monitor itself. So if I do pinch to zoom, as you can see, it works just as good as 
uh, your phone or tablet. So that's a multi-touch feature of the screen. So another feature which basically is this is basically advertise that is that uh, auto rotate. So if I let's see if I can able to do that. There you go. I don't know if you guys can see that. So it's perfect for reading a book or anything. Just still to touch the screen it works as well. Go back. And go back here. Let's again open on the other window. Let's go back here. Works really nice. Uh, so let's see if you want to switch. Um, inputs now we want to go back to your Xbox click on that and we are back to our Xbox you can see right now it's loading uh, Assassin's Creed it's probably gonna be uh, take a little while mm -hmm. all right so we got Assassin's Creed loaded up See, it looks look quite nice on that. I haven't experienced any any input lag, uh, but from a lot of people that I've heard and where before is using uh, using a portable monitor, they usually see uh, some kind of lag, especially the playing uh, games which require fast reflexes like first-person shooters I uh, haven't experienced much yet there might be a little bit of lag compared to if I'm playing it on a high refresh rate uh, PC monitor or playing on my TV uh, there's very very slight bit of uh, lag you might see uh, compared to what I'm seeing right now that, that when I try to move the, the character uh, it's there but I it's it's very barely noticeable um, so I don't think that it'll affect uh, your gaming unless you're doing um, competitive gaming and then for that I'll definitely will not recommend uh, using a portal monitor whether this one or anyone uh, because you need to have the best of the best at that point so might as well go with a proper monitor uh, but for everyday gaming uh, I don't see any issue uh, use, using this monitor Here you can see how the fire looks on that. All right, so I'm going to switch over to uh, connecting my Samsung um, Note plus, uh, 10 Plus just to show you how Dex works. That was probably one of the primary reason of getting uh, looking for or looking for a uh, touchscreen monitor uh, because I wanted to use Dex. I already had a 17-inch monitor that I've been really happy with, uh, 
but it did, it did not have a touch screen. Um, so to utilize DeX, uh, it works. Uh, the 7 inch works with a with mouse, but the basically defeats the purpose if you're utilizing just your phone. Uh, and especially on, on the go, you just want to have a uh, phone connected and do, do not want to have extra keyboard or mouse running. Um, so touch screen works a lot better on that case. Uh, so let me pause this game and see if we can go to Dex now. All right, so I got my note connected here. Uh, as you can see, it brings up uh, Dex and all my apps show up pretty, pretty well. You can see on the top, it shows uh, Samsung Dex that's running right now. I know for some reason uh, everything leaks a little bit overexposed. I think it's just just the uh, my camera that I'm using right now. So I was mentioning that for decks uh, looks pretty well because you can utilize all the same functionality as your phone. All your Touch screen menus, uh, everything, the pinch to zoom, uh, it works great. This is a picture from the monitor that I was just showing you earlier. Some graphics uh, about the gameplay from Prolution. Uh, this is the menu for, for the monitor, uh, touch screen, and some bell field playing on the same monitor. Just to give you an idea. And here's a menu uh, from Xbox setting, which shows the different resolutions that this monitor supports. As you can see it supports 4K 24 and 60 Hertz, and even HDR 10. Uh, so as Xbox is seeing that it's a HDR device connected. And here's another picture of my Surface Pro connected to the. Uh, to this monitor just to show you the size difference. This is a 15 inch monitor connected and surface is I believe 12.1 uh, inch screen if I'm not mistaken and here's uh, Dex running Call of Duty so pretty sweet so that's all I have uh, for today guys uh, Feel free to uh, message me if you have any questions or comments regarding this monitor or anything. Uh, please do like and subscribe.